football is every couple of days for you at the moment. But I suppose when it comes along a cup quarter final, it's it's just excitement and ready for the next one. Yeah, uh, we are excited because uh, that's the first trophy what we won uh, last year, and uh, we want to continue uh, continue that. We want to bring him home and. Uh, Tomorrow, the the winning mentality needs to be there. It was a tough game against Motherwell in the league. First Celtic mm-hmm. recently, I think it's fair to say that. How do you view tomorrow's game, then, bearing that in mind? Yeah, very fair to say that, but uh, I think that we had uh, maybe six great chances, but we didn't score. And then, uh, obviously, uh, mine and uh, Joe Hart mistakes. Uh, that happens, but uh, I think that we get comfortable with the ball and uh, if we do that tomorrow, that uh, we take the ball uh, to our team, uh, play possession, uh, play how we do and uh, that we will take the chances what we create. It was the, the first trophy you, you won last season. How important psychologically do you think it is to win the first trophy of the season? Uh, was most important for us because uh, we didn't know each other very well but uh, after that uh, we take that confidence uh, during the season uh, because we didn't start good in the season but uh, like you can see after the cup uh, we improve a lot uh, we didn't get beaten I don't know 27 games something like that uh, I think that that shows everything about our character and um, it's a good to have uh, one more trophy in your pocket. <laughs> um, obviously, Anthony started at the weekend. How do you feel about the situation when sometimes Anthony does and yourself? Uh, we have a great uh, squad, uh, around 28 players. Uh, everybody uh, needs a chance. Uh, everybody wants opportunity to play for an uh, amazing club like Celtic. And uh, I think whoever plays, that uh, we show that uh, we have great players who, who are waiting and uh, that they will do everything to win the matches. These cup games, you know, they're just one-off knockouts, especially away from home. How tough can they be and how hard is it to, to get yourself up for it and make sure that you are on it for 90 minutes? Because if you lose, of course, you, you, you get knocked out. Yeah, but uh, I think that we live for that moment, uh, that one game can change your life. Uh, especially if uh, you want to show yourself in the good sign. Uh, and um, I think that this game will be different, but again, our fans will be with us and uh, they will cheer for us and we will do everything to bring them happiness to the faces. Just wanted to ask you as well about your, your own personal form. How, how do you feel that you're playing at the moment and how much is, is the World Cup Obviously, it's only about a month away, but how much is that playing on your mind and are you wanting to, to keep your form really going so you go straight into that well with Croatia? You know, uh, if you are playing bad, then uh, national team coach will not call you. Uh, you don't think about the World Cup. OK, it's close, but uh, you need to keep your form here in the club and then uh, hopefully I will get a call. Uh, but if I'm secured to play there, no, I'm not. Nobody, nobody is maybe uh, just Luka Modric or somebody else. But uh, you know, I'm young. I'm learning stuff, and um, I want to be first good person and then uh, good football player. What do you feel? Do you feel that something clicked on Saturday in in that game that hadn't maybe happened in the previous games? Um, I think that we take our chances. Uh, we score goals finally. And uh, that was the most important thing. And because before that we had chances, but we didn't score. That was getting frustrating. But uh, this game, we finally opened the door and we just keep pushing. I just asked you about James Forrest. I think maybe before uh, the weekend's game, some people may have written him off in a Celtic jersey. What What does he bring to the team when he's playing, but also when he's not playing as well? Yeah, but I have just one word, he is legend. He is just legend, uh, like a person. I like him a lot. From first day when I come here, he was like maybe second, for first was captain. 
but he was second or third who was welcome me here and uh, what can I say uh, he's a true Celtic legend uh, green and white he's he's maybe I can say uh, when I was coming here uh, I only heard about him and Callum to be honest uh, Forrest was uh, you know uh, great great football player and um, like you you can see now you cannot write somebody off he is here he scored three goals he's having 100 goals for celtic that's a lot